Hello, this is video 43. I'm, I'm kind of just in shock at how quickly this has gone. Um, and it's one of those things, this is my accountability time. This is my uh, time to look at the week, last week, at the week ahead, and really have a, a think about where I'm going, the direction, what I'm doing, and share it with you. So this is my accountability. I hope you enjoy and I hope it helps see where I'm going and what I'm doing. Hello, my name is Mark and I'm here to help you live a better, healthier life. My goal is to help as many people as I can get into shape and improve their quality of life. Now, if this is your first time here and you want to learn more about practical and effective ways to improve your health and fitness, then start now by hitting the subscribe button and the notification bell so you have no reason to miss any videos in the future. And now, without further ado, let's jump right in. So let's start off with accountability. As always, uh, it is one of those things where this week, um, it was a little bit of an odd one. Um, I had, as I talked about in the last video, I had planned on a, a long weekend of work with healthy snacks and everything else. Um, and to, it, for it to be really quite a hard um, you know, weekend you know, with this big piece of work at, at work. Big piece of work at work. Um, oddly enough, that got cancelled at the last minute, which was um, frustrating, annoying and nice, all rolled into one. Um, but it meant that I had a weekend that was unplanned. I had planned to barely have enough time to see the missus and walk the dogs. Uh, the rest of it was planned as being work or supporting work. You know, and it's one of those things where it left me kind of in a little bit of an odd place. Um, it was lovely having free time, but I kept waking up in the middle of the night going, there's something I haven't done. There's something I haven't done. Oh no, no, it's been cancelled. Uh, I don't need to do that. So it's not that I haven't done it, it's that it wasn't needed to be done. So all I'm saying is a very weird, weird you know, weekend. It led to um, a, a couple of beers on one evening, which I don't normally drink, but I did have a couple of beers. It led to the eating of the healthy snacks, um, which you know is fine because they were healthy, um, but because they were there, they needed eaten. Um, it led to uh, some longer walks with the dogs and it led to me playing some computer games which I didn't think I'd have time for. So all in all, it was a really nice weekend. I didn't you know, go off the rails and eat you know, you know, masses of cakes and you know, all those unhealthy snacks that I used to you know, love. Lie, I still love, I just don't eat them anymore or in very small you know, doses and infrequently. Um, so, from an accountability point of view, it was a little bit weird. Um, you know, it was an odd week just because the way it felt. But my exercise was about right. I, I still need to improve the the distance, uh, and, you know, on a regular basis. You know, but going to the gym, you know, going to do the dog walks, doing some exercise at home. I think the exercise is about right. It's certainly nice from my point of view, going to the, to the, the gym with the, the personal trainer, the weights that I'm lifting, the, the amount of reps that I'm doing are going up, you know, noticeably going up. So that's quite nice. I'm still a sweaty mess every time I come back from the gym, but in a positive and nice way. So um, when I say positive and nice way, I don't really don't mean positive. I'm a sweaty mess. I am just a sweaty mess. But it's quite nice seeing the weights and the reps going up to get me into that sweaty mess place. So that's a good thing. The diet has been okay. Um, it slipped a little bit in terms of what I'm doing. Um, not so much in the amount of calories I'm having, but just in terms of getting the right calories. So I need to refocus on that next week. I found myself this week eating more carbs than, than I have been in, in recent weeks, uh, which I know for me, carbs are not my friend. They really aren't. Um, you know, I know everybody's different, but for me personally, carbs hate me. They do. Carbs hate me. It's just a fact. Carbs 
do not like me. We'll talk about more about that in terms of the plans for the next week. But certainly from a, this week point of view, from an accountability point of view, my calories have been about right, but my carbs have been heavy. My exercise is okay. The gym um, and things are going fine, but I need to increase my walking efforts. I'm walking for about 40 minutes uh, um, a morning with the dogs. I need to step that back up to what it was, which was about an hour. Um, things are getting a bit cooler um, out there. The temperatures are dropping a little bit uh, as we get into September uh, and, and onwards. Um, so hopefully that'll make me more energetic. Heat just makes me a bit lethargic and it's much more effort to go and do those uh, exercise things. So that's where we are with now in terms of accountability, um, in terms of what I'm doing, all the rest of it. So yeah, actually not bad week, just slightly odd without that weekend work that I'd planned for months for. Uh, but yes. Okay, so the week ahead. And before we get into this, if you're enjoying this video, please do smash that like button because it does help get this video out to hopefully help and inform other people. So, week ahead. So, it is one of those things where um, in this week ahead, I've got a little bit of time off that I plan to take after that weekend of work. Um, I've decided I'm just going to take it anyway. So I'm going to try and do uh, at least a couple of eight and nine kilometer walks with the dogs spaced out through the week uh, and trying to increase my my walking time to about an hour, um, which you know, will increase the distance I'm going. Um, I also primarily this week need to get my arse in gear when it comes to, you know, actually doing the shopping and actually doing um, uh, the higher protein, higher fat, lower carbohydrate, you know, kind of meal plan. Last week, it wasn't so much as cheating as it just became very easy to, to get the pasta and rice on, um, which is not a bad thing, but that's a weakness of mine. I know that one of my my eating habits is just gorging on on pasta and rice uh, which i know doesn't work for my body type it carbs are bad for me carbs are bad you need them they're essential but too many of them are bad for me um so i need to get back to to more protein more fat less carbohydrates so i'm going to work on that this week in terms of the meal plan like I said, I've got some time off, so I want to get a good couple of long walks in. Um, thankfully, where we live, there are lots of walks to do within minutes of the house. Um, so you can quite comfortably do, you know, nine, ten kilometres without re you know, retracing much of your steps, apart from the last little bit to the front door. So going to be doing that. Um, and obviously, gym as usual um, for this week. So this week is, you know, nice. I'm not saying it's going to be a typical week. I am going to increase the walking distance because I've got a couple of days off uh, from work. I am going to walk a little bit further with the dogs and I want that one to be a trend that starts from now on. Now that it's getting cooler and, you know, um, less. I'm not very good in the heat. So less hot equals good. Um, and sort out that diet. Just cut down a little bit on the carbohydrates. I don't think I was much uh, over my my calories that I'm aiming for, if if any if I was over at all. But carbs are, like I said, not my friend. So I need to have more protein, more fat, less carbohydrates. So I'm going to work on that this week. So that's where we are for the week ahead. Um, keeping it quite simple. Um, but doing a little bit more exercise than will be typical this week because I've got a few days off. So I'm going to enjoy that. Uh, play some computer games as well, but also step up the, the, the exercise. Why not? It's nice to get out and about. It's nice to actually get in touch with, with uh, nature. And it really does help my head. It clears it. I feel better about it. So that's the plan for this week. As always, if you've got this far in the video, I want to say a big thank you very much for all the support that you've been showing through this. It really has been a great experience over, you know, two, four fifths of a year, 43 weeks. Um, it feels like it's gone in a blink of an eye. Um, I just want to say a big thank you for all the support. It really has meant a lot to me. 
I hope it's been useful and you're enjoying it. And I will see you in the next video.